amigas, my name is Danette and well, now I'm three years in hormones. It's amazing. I never thought I would make it this far, but you know, yes, I'm here and I'm here more than talk about hormones, is talk about what was the three years, you know, and I gotta tell you guys, it was horrible. Like two years ago, it was complete horrible. I have so much rejection for society. I have so much rejection for my family. Well, everybody rejects me basically, you know. And well, now uh, the chains are amazing after you turn like three years. This is amazing, really, girls. Everything is there boobs, hips, everything. Your, your arms get mm, not super skinny, but you know, I was really, really, really husky. So, yeah. Well, I think I'm, I really passed now and it's an amazing trip. I have a good job. I really have a good job. I make $17 an hour. I work as a caregiver. I pay all my bills now, so I'm not broke anymore. And everything starts getting adjusted super well. So my life after three years is good. So what was the before three years? It was horrible, guys. Horrible, horrible. Everybody reject me. Um, well, like two years ago, when I did not pass that well, I, my face passed, but my body didn't. So I still look like a man two years ago. And it was a very hard time, you know, and I'm here just to support and tell you how hard it is, you know, and then you have to keep going. If you go to my Facebook page, Nanette Prada, you will know and you will see how did I look before and it's an amazing change. Hormones does a very good job. Don't abuse of them. Use it as directed because it's the way it works. If you use too much, it doesn't work. It actually turns the hormones into testosterone and it's horrible. Well, and I'm going to talk about vices. Makeup girls. I start with horrible makeups. Now, I think I'm okay. I think I can do very good makeup and really the truth is makeup is a big change. I'm not rich. I don't have money to buy, um, you know, to get me my, um, my operation, my face operation to feminize more my body. So I do good makeup. I still look a little bit like a guy or girl, you know, kind of weird, you know, without makeup, but makeup works excellent. So working your makeup, working your hair, working your outfits, because it's very important. Also trying to feminize your voice. My voice is not gonna get really feminized. This is the most I can get as being feminized. This is a lower voice in speech, a pitch I can get and it's really hard for me. So anyway, girls, it's totally worth it. Don't give up. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, because you know what? It's gonna be the time when you're gonna say, fuck you. This chat is not worth it. Your family reject you, your friends reject you, society, wherever you go, you get the bad looks and you know, you have to keep up, you have to keep up, you have to keep up and you know what? You will make it. I make it. So if I make it, every other girl can make it. Trust me, no matter how you look, it's not about if you look beautiful or you have to look like someone else or, or like me, no. You just have to look beautiful enough for yourself and good enough to pass because if you don't pass, you're going to have a hard time. There is a lot of transgender groups that say, no, you don't have to pass. You have to just look the way you are, wherever, you know, some even have mustache and beard and everything, you know, and they look very manly. Those guys have a lot of problem and those girls have a lot of problem. Trust me, feminize to the, to the extreme because that's the only way. That's, trust me, is the only way you survive in, at least in this country, in the United States. And I live in a super conservative little town where people is super conservative. In the beginning, there was a big a house, but now they're so lovely. They understand me and actually I can live there with no problem. Even Anchorage, when, I, when I'm staying there and I work sometimes, well, it's, it's worth it. So yes, girls, it's going to be tough because a girl is not easy. You have to walk like a girl, talk like a girl, look like a girl, especially because if you're going to work, you need to go to the girl's bathroom. And girls don't have that much problem, but boys do. So, but if you look like a girl, well, trust me, girls, you won't have no problem. You will just walk in and get 
into your business and that's it, you know, that's what we do in the bathrooms, you know, we don't sneak or do any crazy stuff, but you know, that's what they think. So trying to feminize yourself, be like a girl, trust me, be like a girl, far like a girl, everything it has to be like a girl, you have to be really delicate in everything, even if girls are not that delicate or that feminine, you have to be more, you know why, because you want to survive in this society and you want to make it. I made it, you can make it, every transgender person that's trying to do this, it has to really do the job. The job is, like me, I'm fem male to female, well, now I finally look like a female, I mean, I will do more operation, I want a bigger boob, just for, just for fun, <laughs> just for fun, I want a bigger boobs and I want a little more of hips and more butt, that I will fix it later with some proceedings. My face, well, I don't know what I will do. But yes, I have to do some work on it and especially my face, you know, because I wanted to look, not that I wanted to look super um, pretty or like a doll, but I want to look very feminine. I'm, I started my transition when I was 47 years old and I'm 50 now. So it's looking at, you know, even hormones, I think it, it gets you a younger looking, you know, because, well, I feel younger and I was been taking care of myself. Girls, one of the biggest advice is diet. I use a diet which makes my body go extreme in two months, okay? Listen, listen to this. This is really important, okay? My diets go two months go um, in extreme exercise and I eat just vegetables and, you know, I don't go more than that, okay? And But I go, I don't eat meats, I don't eat fats, nothing. Two months, I just lose everything, muscle and fat, okay? The third month, okay, listen what I do. The third month, I eat everything. Hamburgers, tacos, burritos, pizza, everything. I fat up myself, okay? And that fat, especially when you're three years in hormones, that fat stays right where you want it, which is in your ass and your hips, okay? And it goes to your boobs too. And you're gonna lose a little bit in these two months of streamies. You will lose some boobs, but you know what? Don't worry. It's gonna work it. And then what you do, just this is the best way to feminize your money. So, well, ask your doctors because you know maybe that's not even healthy. But I've been doing it. You know, two months I do diets and exercise. One month I do a little bit of exercise, but I don't do diet. I just eat like a pig. You know, just like a pig. I eat pizza. I eat ice cream. Well, ice cream. I I eat every day ice cream and I. I eat everyday chocolate, you know, that's good fat for me, you know, I like it, you know, and sometimes I don't eat nothing, you know, but like I'm trying to say is that way, that system that I've been using it, it works perfect. Of course, I don't want to lose my muscle. I want to be strong because, you know, I feel like I'm a strong woman. I wasn't a strong boy, so now I'm a strong woman and I want to be able to punch somebody, somebody in trying to do something to me. And not only that, I want to be strong to work and I want to be strong for many, many things. So don't lose all your muscle, trying to exercise your arms, trying to exercise your legs, you know, and it's a perfect way to exercise, you know. And for your face, girls, you know what? I don't use MAC or nothing of that kind, nothing of that, nothing of that. I use just cheap makeup. I go to the drugstore like Walgreens or here at the gun store like Fred Meyer and I buy a good makeup, very cheap, is NYX. That makeup is super cheap, it's just laid down perfect, you know, and you can look like really good. This makeup, well, this makeup is for a video, so this makeup takes me like 45 minutes just to put it in, you know, but it's worth it because it's for a video and I have to look presentable for you guys. So, well, three years, guys, girls, and I made it, so I'm gonna continue to this, you know, I'm gonna live all my life like this, but so far, this is what I got for three years, well, um, girls, I kiss you, I send you a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of good vibes, and be strong, and be there, because you know what, you need to be tough, you really need to be tough to get into this business, you know, this is not easy, so work, 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 well, bye!